Dame Dalla for three. Dame time. Maybe part of my voice cuts through the insanity of the crowd because they're going wild. I don't try and top the crowd. I just kind of stay a little bit underneath them and let the crowd do the work. Portland Trailblazer fans, loyal, enthusiastic, knowledgeable. They know the game. Ant-Man for three. The origin of Rip City came from Bill Shonley, the original radio guy. He's an icon in Portland. And when he was calling a game, they put a microphone near the basket, and for some reason he heard it. Ball never hit the rim. It went right through at an angle that kind of tore the cords a little bit. You know how you hear that little tear, that little swish? And he said it just came into his mind. He just said, Rip City. And out of that small, impromptu, improvised moment, a legend is born. Rip City, are you ready? Blazers win! It's Wild Wayne, voice of the New Orleans Pelicans. We're returning this week to present your top plays of season two. And look, you can help us award that 100,000 VC. Let's check out the finalist. And the first winner of season two was King Retro's 5TTV. He sent in this crazy bounce lob. You're looking live and down at the Staples Center in downtown Los Angeles, California. The setting for our broadcast tonight. Welcome to a special presentation of the NBA on Christmas Day here on 2K Sports. We want to wish each and every one of you a Merry Christmas. With Greg Anthony and Hall of Famer Doris Burke, this is Kevin Harlan. And joining us on the sidelines, another Hall of Famer, David Aldridge. Hey, Dave. Hey there, Kevin. There were some skeptics when the Lakers first hired Frank Vogel to be their head coach. There are fewer of them now. Anthony Davis says a lot of coaches don't get on their superstars, but he does. Even when we win, he holds us accountable. He comes in every day with the same attitude, never too high or too low. I love his coaching. Kevin? Well, he is a terrific championship coach. David, that says it all. Thanks. Here are the starters for Brooklyn. And the big three out on the perimeter. Irving the one, Harden at the two, and Durant the three. Round out there with Griffin. And for Los Angeles, the two megastars are the big men, LeBron and Davis. And P out there with Russell Westbrook. And it's a reason in at the three spot. And so off the tip, it's Brooklyn. And these Christmas Day games, Greg, have become a cherished NBA tradition. How tough is it, though, for the players to miss this time with their families? It is always a challenge, no doubt. But sometimes you just got to be a little flexible with the schedule. And as long as the kids get their presents, they don't mind too much if it's a day early or a day late. And so it's the Nets getting on the board first. It's stolen by Brown. Right side Irving. Down low. Griffin kicks to Irving. Back to Griffin. Good, and the assist goes to Irving. Pretty pass by Kyrie Irving. Nothing like making your teammate feel good right there. And here's Westbrook. He'll bring it up for the Lakers. Four-point game. Here's Davis. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. It's going to be on Griffin. Yeah, way to play in attack mode and get to the line. Los Angeles At shooting the their first free throws of the night. Anthony Davis taking two shots. First free throw is good. And one thing I'll never forget about Davis is when he lit up the All-Star game in 2017. Racked up 52 points in that game. That smashed the old record by 10. A 
And so Anthony Davis nails both of them. About a minute played so far here in the first. Irving passes to KD. Griffin trying to get open. Makes it off the glass. Yeah, Kevin Durant working right there on the interior. This guy, if you allow him to touch the paint, he will put it home. Here's Los Angeles now. About a minute and a half through the first quarter. Westbrook, no good. Well, that's a blown defensive coverage, but it doesn't matter. He cannot answer the bell. And a fortunate turn of events for Brown last year. Of course, he was traded from one of the worst teams to one of the best. And what I respect is how scrappy, how hard playing, how defensive-minded a guard this guy is. But he's also willing to fit perfectly around stars. He finds a way to do all the dirty work and make himself a factor. Lakers shooting their third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. And the season numbers for them at the line thus far are, are really poor. Something I'm sure they are making a point of emphasis. He's off on the first. And what I like about MP, it's the confidence with which he plays. He feels like he can go at anyone in the league. That one misses. Last outing for the Nets. They won that game against the Trailblazers in Portland. Oh, Griffin in position, and the slam by Blake Griffin. Yeah, I feel like they could execute this play in their sleep. Griffin, one of the premier alley-oop finishers in the league. Westbrook passes to MP. Back to Westbrook, and stolen by Kyrie Irving. Drops in the layup for two. And the story here, yes, Kevin, early on, on is Kevin how well Durant. they shot the basketball. The pass to James. He's looking for MP and finds him. And the rejection by Harden. And a wide open look for Irving. A three pointer is right on target. Irving's got five points so far. So the Lakers call timeout their first. And no doubt, Coach wants them to shore up their interior defense. I think right now they're giving up way too many easy looks. That is a recipe for disaster. And a little over two and a half minutes gone here in the first. Ariza outside. Nice ball movement here by the Lakers. MP and out of bounds is Brooklyn gains possession. Brooklyn ball. And now another look at that mobile one block defensive performance. And an early swat like that can really set the tone. Now the shooters will be feeling his presence. Harden scanning the floor. And the foul called on MP. MP. That's his first foul. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. And in this first quarter, about three minutes played. Bobbed up there for KD. Throws down the alley oop slam. Well, you cannot let Kevin Durant have that much room to take off. This guy is tremendous as an alley oop finisher. James finds Ariza. Passes it to Davis. Westbrook with it. Double team on Westbrook. To the middle. Six on the shot clock. And there's the bucket from MP. When you get that kind of solid positioning, it does not matter what you send an MP. The concentration and the finishing ability is there. Now, here is Irving. Five points in the game. For three, Durant. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. Left side, Westbrook. To the inside, James. Great pass to set up the lay-in. James has got it back down to a single-digit deficit for the Lakers. Irving against Ariza. Irving passes to Durant.
Westbrook pulls it in. Boy, this guy is a good finisher, so he misses a chippy. That's tough to take. Here's Davis and misses it off the right side of the rim. Brooklyn leading by nine. Here's Brown and the rejection by James. Wow, LeBron James sends it back emphatically. That was a message, folks. That's good from Davis on the extension by MP. And their post play has been really solid right off the bat. Irving against Westbrook. Now here's Harden. He's guarded close. It's hauled in by MP. And so MP will bring it up for the Lakers. They trail by seven. Their last game, a win against San Antonio, looking to carry that into this one. And I credit the shot selection in that one. It's hard to stay patient, but you I see really the reward. Well, typically, really? Greg, great decision-making leads to great shooting percentages. I thought that team played a very smart game. For Los Angeles, they've gone three of seven from the field since we've gotten underway. Reeves it is to Westbrook. Pass to MP. That's good, and so Westbrook comes up with the assist. MP's got his second bucket. Well, the defense always so attentive to Russ, and he knows, okay, you're going to send defensive attention my way. I will find an open teammate. Irving misses. Lakers trail by eight. Pass to James. Westbrook surveying the D. MP, no good. And the foul called on MP. That'll be his second. Nets leading by 13. And a moment now to reset the lineups, courtesy of Gatorade, all fueled up for the second quarter of basketball. Setting the floor for the Nets. They've got Kyrie Irving, Lakers, Paul Millsap oh. out there with Durant, MVP. and it's Harden, and it's Claxton in at the pivot foul. spot, manning the middle. First team foul. Here's Harden, and the jam by Harden. Well, we think of Durant as a naturally gifted scorer. Fact is, this guy understands how to get his teammates open. And on our sideline, our reporter, David Aldridge. Hey guys, MP in the last time out against the Spurs came through when they needed him. He tallied 25 points, and that scoring outburst set a new season high for him in what became a great exhibition on his part. At the line, he performed that, really well. And I could see his role expanding if he continues to make that kind of impact, Kevin. Thanks for the report, David. You have to love the energy he brought in that last game. Yeah, he was the team's driving force, and tonight, maybe more of the same. Well, I think what he has shown is when they send two in his direction, he is willing to make the pass and trust his teammates to make plays so critical. And we see teams around the league trying to integrate star veterans with talented rookies. Greg, it's not always easy, is it? Not at all, Kevin. And a lot of times it becomes a choice between win now or win later. Though the teams with great coaching and development can oftentimes do both. Defense doesn't get much better than the mobile one block we just saw on replay. And that has got to help the morale of this team. Let's see if that sets up a run here. Now, here's MP. He had 25 points in the win against San Antonio. And let's not forget about the assist. This guy is a playmaker with a driving force for that offense. And guys, they continue to put a lot of pressure on the interior defenders with their work down low. KD passes to Claxton. Claxton coming off the assist from KD. Claxton's got his first bucket in this one. Here's Jordan. And it's Jordan with the jam. What a read from MP. I love how he looks to get it to his open teammates. MP against Harden. At the top of the key, Millsap. Back to Harden. And Harden with the stuff. That's a finish he'll be bragging about for a while. <laughs> As he should. Very impressive. How about that from your point guard, gentlemen? Playing big at the rim. Okay. Reeves it is to MP. Out 
outside Durant. Offline with his three. Lakers trail by 16. There's the pass to MP. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. I know Trevor Ariza has been a bit of a journeyman, but he is also a proven champion. On the defensive end, you know he's going to take pride in locking down his man. Taking two shots. And he knocks down the first one. Ariza hits them both. And it's Harden with the ball for Brooklyn. Fresh from a win against Portland. And bottom line, they found ways to score. Credit the game plan going in. It was right on the money. And that's not an easy environment to play in. To score at the rate they did on the road says a lot about their intensity and focus. Nicholas Foxton. Second quarter of play with almost three minutes gone. MP passes to Horton Tucker. Back to MP. And out of bounds as Brooklyn gains possession. One thing Irving's been doing more of, using his offhand in the lane to hit floaters, and even on jump shots. This guy is so creative, so inventive. The ability to make last-second adjustments, and I mean that whether he's in the air off his feet or with his handle, his ability to keep defenders guessing is truly incredible. Bruce Brown, who's checked in for Durant. So it's the Lakers now, following the three-point attempt by Kyrie Irving. Here in the second quarter, just under three and a half minutes played. Step back on that one and let it fly. Irving's got ten points. And now we'll get a perspective here on the hustle game how it's been going for the Nets. And it's been about their defense. They're the playing with a frenetic pace, oh, a lot of pressure on the ball handlers and forcing turnover. As something else they've done right from the get-go tonight is run. So much of their offense coming on the fast break. And more than one observer, Greg, has called Irving the most entertaining player in the game. What do you think? A lot of competition for that distinction. But Irving does some things that no one else can, at least at his level and then you never know when he's going to give us a juicy sound bite. Los Angeles making a switch here. Howard's checked in. It's a nice passing here by Los Angeles. Pass to a reason. Lock at six. But three. And throw the ball out of bounds. Jordan touched it last. No clue where that pass was going. That is a brutal turnover. Brooklyn leading by 18. Pass to Harden. The kick out to Irving. Brown outside. Here's Claxton. The shot that time, not on target. And the Lakers take it the other way. MP outside to the paint. Here's Howard. Second shot opportunity. A nice shot by Jordan. And I like the fact that he really was unfazed by that scoreless first quarter. And now you can see him getting into a rhythm. Now here's Harden. Monk defending. outside Lakers trail by 16 here's Monk still looking for his first bucket in this one Howard gets to a reason MP up top a 
Ariza against Brown. On the wing, Monk over Harden. Gets the front of the rim and out. Well, defenses are content to give up the mid-range, right? It's not the high percentage restricted area or the three. You can see they're prepared to give up that shot. And inside Harden is such a difficult cover. Get too close, and you know he'll cleverly draw a foul. Now, here's Monk. Taking a look at his stats, he's averaging around nine and a half points a game. MP passed. Oh! oh. Uh -oh. That is a grown man move for Dwight Howard. And here's Harden. Pass to Claxton. This is to Irving. And the pass to Millsap. Five on the clock. Shoots from the corner. And Irving gets it to go on the assist by Paul Millsap. Irving's got 12 points in the game. His shooting has been outstanding here. <laughs> Definitely one of the reasons they're up in this game. Los Angeles calls timeout. And Greg, you are a hard-nosed defender. Would you be frustrated by what they're calling a foul today? You know, I, I would based on how I played, but if you grew up in this era, this is just the way the game is, and you have to adapt and adjust, and that's what you're seeing with the players. Guys can defend it every bit as good as they ever have. In fact, I would argue they're better defensively today because they're not allowed to grab and hold. So the league is focused on offense. The fans seem to love it. But at the end of the day, you still got to get after it defensively. Los Angeles with some changes. Davis is checked in for Jordan. James comes in for Trevor Ariza. And Russell Westbrook is subbed in for MP. And then for Brooklyn, Aldrich comes in for Paul Milson. And it's Blake Griffin in for Nicholas Claxton. Monk with the ball. He's still scoreless so far in this one. And no good that time. Nice D from Griffin. Passes to Irving. And it's Aldridge, top of the key. Back to Irving. Let's it go with a three. Rebounded by the Lakers. He has that confidence rolling, hitting two threes in the first, but he hasn't had one since. Now let's go to the sideline and catch up with our Hall of Famer, David Aldridge. Thank you, Kevin. Well, the Brooklyn Nets are creating a fresh legacy. Kevin Durant says it's new energy. We're one of the first teams in Nets history where fans are expecting us to do good things. The basketball culture is deep in Brooklyn, and they're looking for a team to latch on to. Well, guys, it looks like they found a good one. I agree, David. Thanks. I'll tell you, most of the time, this guy's going to finish that. But that was tremendous defense that prohibits him from completing the play. James, the pass to Howard. And it's Dwight Howard with the finish. Well, the playmaking ability of LeBron James may be his best skill in a wealth of incredible skills. Harden gets the bucket. And I'll tell you, the team is simply riding the hot hand. This guy has been lights out. Pass to Monk. Here's James. Now Howard. He's averaging a bit over five points a game. James with it, and it's Harden picking him up. Back to Howard. In the hoop for his third pick from the field. He's three for four thus far in the contest. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now, especially on the interior. Round the pass to Harden. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. That's his first. Sudden Whitehouse. 
and just so difficult to guard the beard without fouling. Hart is constantly seeking out contact. Taking two shots. First one falls for him. And really an incredible playmaker his entire career. The Harden has taken that up a notch. And he now often looks for his teammates first. Here's what the Lakers are going with right now. Anthony's checked in for Howard. Rajon Rondo subbed in for Malik Monk. And a change for the Nets. Mills has checked in. Harden hits them both. And huge assist totals for Harden, which is also a reflection, Greg, of the talent around him. And he's played with some of the best finishers in the game throughout his career. What changed starting last year uh, was his mindset, making him all that much more difficult to defend. He was all alone on that one. Anthony's got himself on the board with three there. Yeah, they've raised their shooting percentage in this quarter, and they're starting to get on track. Round with it, picked up by Davis. Round kicks to Aldridge. Pass to Harden from past the arc. And a great assist James by Aldridge Harden. as that one goes in. Aldridge has got his third assist on the night. The pass to Davis. The tray. It's rebounded by Aldridge. Boy, he won't miss many from that spot. The defense gets lucky there. Now, here's Mills. Guarded closer. And it's going to be out of bounds. The Nets will retain possession. against Anthony shot clock at six round kicks to Aldridge and you might want to think about working it inside more the threes were falling earlier but that's changed here in the second back to Westbrook that's in and he found his range with that one now one for two and they're forcing the ball inside and it's working like a charm here's Harden it's not going to go for him. So the Lakers will take it the other way. Westbrook with it. Picked up by Aldridge. Loads it up for Davis. And Davis throws it down. And I tell you, the brow, he might be the best player in our league. With that reach, you just throw it up around the rim, and he's bringing it home. Here's Harden. And no good. Westbrook with the nice D there. And here's Westbrook. He'll bring it up for the Lakers. A 12-point game. Their next game is at the Rockets Arena in Houston for a game with the Rockets. That'll be the first half of a two-game trip. Westbrook against Harden. 103 left to play here in the second quarter. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. And for a player with Blake Griffin's physical makeup, it was a big adjustment when he had to deal with injury issues. He's really had to reshape his body and his game. one at the line is good. No wasted trips at all. They're taking care of business at the... Horton Tucker's checked in for Rajon Rondo. And a change for the Nets. Kevin Durant, he's checked in for LaMarcus Aldridge. Griffin hits them both. And just over 80% from the line right now. A big improvement over what they shot in that first quarter. Westbrook passes to Carmelo. He dishes it to LeBron. 46 seconds left in the first half of basketball. It's good, and the Brooklyn lead is cut to just nine on the basket from Anthony. 
and defensively, they are on their heels every time the ball comes inside. Passes it to KD. Over LeBron. And again, it's the Nets missing. They've been the better rebounding team by a healthy margin, but it hasn't been enough. At the elbow, Westbrook. Over Mills. Here's Davis. Another shot. And that's two points on the way. Davis has got his third basket of the night right there. Terrific physicality from Davis on the offensive glass, creating another opportunity and scoring. And he just dangles from the bucket after sending that one through. And you can see which team has the swagger right now. Well, well he knew how many inches he had over the guy. I mean, let's face it, good decision to just rise up and take the jump shot. And so we conclude the first half. Nets out in front, up by seven. Live from the Staples Center, you're watching 2K Sports.
we welcome you back to NBA action, a great tradition, Christmas Day basketball here on 2K Sports. An exceptional performance so far from James Harden. Yeah, and just look at the numbers from the first half. He has been very efficient. I think they've taken their time. They've showed incredible patience. It's a sign of a well-coached ball club. The two megastars are the big men, LeBron and Davis. Russell Westbrook out there with MP. And it's a reason in at the small forward position. That's the group starting the second half for Frank Vogel. Pass to Davis. Good, and the assist goes to MP. MP's got four assists now tonight. With just how long AD is, he can take hits and still get to the bucket. Irving against Westbrook. Irving can't get it to go. Lakers trail by seven. MP finds Davis. And that one, good. Davis has got 12 in the game. Yeah, the added muscle Davis has put on, helping him on these tough finishes. Flexing on him there. Griffin. And Davis pulls it down. Davis has got four rebounds now tonight. MP dishes to Westbrook. And now in the second half of his career, Russell Westbrook wants his rings. He knows he's getting older and has no time to waste. It's why he plays with such passion. And the first one drops. Boy, what a consistent stretch of basketball over a number of years for Russell Westbrook. Remember, he's got an MVP, a couple of scoring titles, and most important of all, guys, he's contributed to winning. So he hits one of two from the strike. Nets leading by four. Brown feeling out of it. Pass to KD. Over James. Durant. That's good. 15 points in the game. And Westbrook's high motor is why we love him. He goes out, Greg, and competes every play in every game. Uh, no doubt, but I tell you what, he's tired of missing out on the NBA Finals. This is a guy that is hungry to get back to that stage. It'll be interesting to see if he can get it done. Here's Westbrook. Yes, it's James picking up the assist. James has got four assists in the game. Well, this is a go-to shot for Russell Westbrook. That mid-range ability, just where he is so confident and comfortable. Second half of play with just under two and a half minutes gone. Harden with it. Picked up by Davis. It's Durant on the wing. Trying to get open is Irving. And it's Kevin Durant with the three. Durant's got five points now this quarter. And here's Westbrook. He'll bring it up for the Lakers. They trail by seven. Here's MP. Rebounded by the Nets. KD's got four rebounds now tonight. And I'll tell you, they're going to need more from this guy James if they're going Harden. to cut into this deficit. This An elite score takes pride in torching defenses. Hart is outstanding at getting to his spots and capitalizing. MP passes to Davis. And they double up Davis. And a bit of a battle here for the ball. The official signals a jump ball here. An outstanding defensive play to earn the mobile one block. And guys, that block could really help change the momentum of this game. And the Lakers have possession. Westbrook against Irving. Kicks it out to LeBron. On the clock. Over Harden. That one a little long. Nets leading by nine. Inside. And it's Brown that time on the assist by Irving. Irving's got six assists now in the game. Big miscommunication on defense. He recognizes it and quickly takes advantage. And that's typical of this guy. He's always reading the situation, reacting quickly and capitalizing. Los Angeles calls timeout. You gotta like what Harden has done in this game so far. Guys, you have got to find a way to slow this man down. This is a great timeout.
Bush Claxton's checked in for the Nets. Third quarter action in just under three and a half minutes have gone. Now the pass to Davis. Ariza outside. To the inside. MP. And that time, also a missed shot. Boy, the wheels have definitely fallen off in this quarter. He cannot buy one. Harden outside. Pass to KD. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. LeBron's got his fifth rebound right now in the game. Down low. And he gets the basket. Officials blowing the whistle, so a chance at the line for one more. How about the tenacity from MP against stiff defense there? Drawing a good foul and getting the shot to go. And a moment to look at the scoring approach in terms of where the points are coming from for Brooklyn. They keep piling up the assists, and they haven't cooled off at all. They've gotten out on the break over and over tonight as well. A lot of baskets coming in transition. Free throw good, MP. And the way Russell Westbrook racks up triple doubles is just incredible. Does it so often. A testament, Doris, to his strong work ethic. I mean, this guy plays with such competitive spirit on both ends of the floor. Russell is relentless. He will sacrifice his body, and his teammates appreciate the effort he gives every single night. DeAndre Jordan's checked in for the Lakers. Well, assists like that have typified their effort today. Terrific ball movement. Ariza outside. Back to Westbrook. Howard against Milson. Howard, the pass to Ariza. And it's slammed in by Ariza. Well, so smooth, so easy in pick and roll. Ariza reads the defense and takes what they give him. He has a chance now to catch up with the fourth member of our crew, Hall of Famer David Aldridge. Thank you for the baton, Kevin. Kyrie Irving, of course, marches to the beat of his own drum. At times, that might rub people the wrong way. But Kyrie says, I've learned oh, lessons from him. Oh, That's the most beautiful and exciting part, just the growth. What I'm saying is, it's always been bigger than the game for me. And guys, you have to respect his willingness to go it alone. You do indeed, D.A. Thank you for that portrait. And this is his fourth trip to the free throw line tonight. Not the best statistic for him in terms of his performance at the line. Very low numbers. Brooklyn leading by eight. To the paint. Claxton with the bucket. Claxton's got six. Well, known for being a terrific passer, he shows you right there. Case in point. Westbrook passes to Jordan. Lobbed up there for Howard. Here's Irving. 14 points for him. And Durant gets it to go. The assist by Irving. Irving's got assist number seven for him tonight. After hitting nothing from downtown in the first half, that's his second make since. For Los Angeles, they've done a solid six of 11 when shooting here in the third quarter. The feed to MP. And the basket is good, and he's got a chance here for one more at the line. It's scary when MP is going off like this. His adrenaline starts flowing, the teammates getting pumped, and then it's like a runaway train. This will be his fifth trip to the free throw line. Horton Tucker's checked in for Trevor Ariza. Shooting one. And the free throw, no good. And the great thing about Durant, he gives you a lot of everything. Yeah, it goes way beyond being versatile. This guy is a great shooter, an elite historical scorer. Rebounder, passer, shot blocker, one of the most complete players in the history of the game. And it's sent back by Howard. There's a reason Dwight Howard has so many all defensive teams to his credit. Good night with the block. They're finding lanes to the hoop now with consistency. Five buckets in a row from the paint. Feeds it to Irving. Good. It's Harden with the assist that time. Irving's got four points in the quarter. And while his ability to score gets so much attention, Harden demonstrating why he's also regarded as an elite-level passer. 
Horton Tucker, the pass to Howard. Count that one, and the next lead has been cut down to nine in the bucket from Horton Tucker. He is still commanding a lot of defensive attention. Howard just keeps his head up and finds the open man. Irving passes to KD, takes it inside, and then Durant with the jam. Oh, taking it to the rack with power, hammering down the two-hand slam. Pass to MP. Here's the dish to Howard. Outside, KD. Rebounded by Howard. Howard's got four rebounds in this game. Pass to MP. Here's Horton Tucker. To the middle. Jordan trying to free himself up. That one's good. And the Brooklyn is cut to just nine on the basket from Howard. That makes it 10 of their last 12 coming from inside the paint. And there's the pass to Claxton. Westbrook against Irving. A shot by Harden. Wide open. And again, Brooklyn with the triple. Their ability, again, to stretch the floor, particularly in this second half. And guys, boy, when you're hitting, it sure does work. It obviously opens up major options at the offensive end. The kick out to Westbrook. Over KD. Here's MP. Jordan trying to free himself up. No good with the layup. Boy, a really tough quarter for this guy. Just struggling to make shots right now. Here's Harden driving inside. Boy, the wingspan of DeAndre Jordan. This guy sends it back with a message. And Los Angeles with some changes. Carmelo Anthony is checked in for Howard. Rajon Rondo is subbed in for MP. Then for the Nets, LaMarcus Aldridge is checked in for Millsap. And it's Mills in for James Harden. Here. Davis has checked in for DeAndre Jordan. James comes in for Carmelo Anthony. Trevor Ariza's checked in for Horton Tucker. And MP subbed in for Rajon Rondo. Then for the Nets, Griffin's checked in for Aldridge. Bruce Brown comes in for Nicholas Claxton. And it's James Harden in for Patty Mills. And you can just see his confidence is rising. Bucket after bucket from long range. Setting the floor for the Nets. Irving is out there with Harden. Then there's Griffin, and it's Durant, and it's Brown in at the four-man position. The dynamic rag between players and officials is always interesting, with some players saying they think there's a lot of room for improvement. What do you think? Well, we do see players getting teed up for simply making their case, and, and really the guys just want to play. So, yeah, you, you love to see a little bit more harmony out on the floor, and... Maybe we need to get those two groups together in the offseason to break bread and try to smooth over their relationship. Well, offensively, this guy has been cooking. They're definitely not losing because of him. Shoots from the elbow, and Davis sends it back. And wingspan, mobility, Davis is basically a shooter's nightmare. One of the great shot blockers in the league. MP, and the rejection by Harden. And the MP. foul called on MP. That's his fifth, That's his fifth foul. foul. Fouling Second like that foul. isn't how you get back in the game. Irving passes to KD. Shoots the three. And Irving gets it to go on the assist from KD. Durant's got six assists here tonight. And so Westbrook will bring it up for the Lakers. It's Ariza on the wing. Covered by Irving. Takes it from 10. That one off the back iron and out. After the strong first half, this guy has not been the same. And largely a no-show right here. James Sinks the triple. Three. Heavy incoming from beyond the arc. A key part of their initiative this entire fourth quarter. It feels like they have worked their perimeter game to perfection. Swinging the ball, cashing in from the outside. What a performance. Westbrook finds James. And they double up James. 
And there's the call on James. That'll be his second foul of the game. Some changes for the Lakers. Ellington comes in for Trevor Reese. And it's Malik Monk in for MP. The Nets also changing it up. Paul Millsap's checked in for Griffin. DeAndre Bembry comes in for Brown. And Harris subbed in for Durant. Now, here is Irving. Gets the 14-footer to fall. Irving's got eight points in the quarter. Well, all night he has made an impact at the offensive end. Now he's trying to shut the door. James outside. Good. He hits the LeBron jump shot. James. Now, this is where you'd like the play to end up, right? LeBron James in rhythm off the catch. Irving against Westbrook. Irving passes to Bembry. That one drops for him. Bembry's got his first bucket of the night. Yeah, and, and ever since halftime, they played precision basketball offensively. I gotta believe that's something the coach talked to them about at the halftime. They have valued each possession. And here is Monk. Six on the shot clock. The Lakers need to get a shot off here. A shot's good from Ellington. That's the kind of D that you're not going to find success with, guys. They've got to get a hand in the face. Harden outside. And for top high schoolers, Doris, who want to make a salary instead of going to college, there are now quite a few options. There are, Kevin, and I love it because to me, this is a free market system. So whether you're going overseas, you have the Ignite franchise in the G League. And listen, there may be more options to come, and I think that's a great thing. It's Harden with the drive. And that one drops for him. Harden's got 29. And on the drive, Harden just so tricky to guard. No one wants to risk handing him a foul. Outside Westbrook. James outside. And they recover it. Westbrook passes to LeBron. And the shot LeBron is good. Game. That's 12 points for LeBron. Wow, has Russell he flipped Westbrook. the switch at halftime. Yes, Much yes. more effective here in the second half. Harden outside. Unable to get that one. So the Lakers will take it the other way. Down low. And LeBron throws LeBron. it down. Boy, over two decades now. And LeBron yes, changed sir. power, style, finish, grace, you name it. Irving against Davis. Irving can't get it to go. For Los Angeles, they've gone 7 to 15 from the floor here in the fourth, right around 46 47 percent. James kicks to Monk. Nice ball movement here by the Lakers. Westbrook finds James. The offensive rebound, Davis. And another one in the scoring column for him. He's 7 of 10 from the field. And it's getting late, guys, but all of a sudden they have hope when just a little while ago it looked like hope was lost. Now a timeout call by Brooklyn. And Doris with the financial challenges that the pandemic posed for the NBA. Private equity Man. firms looking to break Yo, into ownership. Lakers Some questions still to be answered with that, don't you think? Oh, I think no doubt, Kevin. And with the rules shifting in recent years to set that minimum ownership stake, it's going to be interesting to see whether this will become a real thing. But I believe if it drives franchise values, there will be momentum gained. All right, look who's coming under the goal. Get loud. Here they are, your Laker girls. All right, look who's coming under the goal. Get loud. Here they are. And now a moment to present the New Balance Player of the Game, Kyrie Irving. And what an amazing ball game we've seen from him. It's been a one-man show, worth the price of admission all by itself. 
There wasn't anything he couldn't do on that court tonight. And as the star of this team, he knows he's going to be the object of the crowd's anger. James looking around. And it's good. Two points. James has got 12 points in just the second half. Well, they're not behind because of this guy. He is putting on a tremendous run. Westbrook against Irving. Kicks it out to Harden. The shot's good. Brown James making the play. Harden. Brown's got his seventh assist of the game with that last one. James against Brown. Passes it to Davis. Doris, there's much argument over how the MVP award should be decided. Whether it's stats, time on the floor, the intangibles, with a winner, with a loser. What criteria do you use when you vote on that award? Well, there's so much that goes into this because, number one, how skilled are you? You have to be one of the most skilled players in the league, in my estimation. Number two, how much do you influence winning? But the fact of the matter is most MVPs finish in the top two or three in their respective conferences. So that's another criteria. I'm just going to say this to you. I will actually poll NBA players as I come across them in the season talking about these awards, these first, second, third team all NBA, because they're the guys lining up opposite and know what goes into what these guys do. And guys, this is where their depth really comes into play. They, they've got such talent at that position. They'd love to have him out there, but they won't suffer much of a drop off. Here's Carter. Off the left rim and out. Los Angeles has gone two or three in the fourth quarter from long range. Good shooting so far. Up top, Bazemore, guarded by Harris. Bazemore gets the bucket. What an effective, efficient offensive possession. They'd love to get that shot every trip down the floor. Outside Thomas, lets the three fly. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. Pops it up for Jordan, and he lays in the alley Rondo just knows how to wheel and deal, and has that exceptional feel for when one of his guys is over. Two minutes remaining in his ball game. Pass to the Bembry. Greg, playing most of your career in the 90s, the game has really changed. Less physical, more skilled, but what role has the league played in all of that change? Well, the, the NBA is at the forefront of these changes. The competition committee that they have that meets annually to discuss ways to try to improve the game. Listen, they're not going to always knock it out of the park, but you have to keep thinking forward. And I applaud the league for their right attempts to try to improve this game right and grow. And this is what they wanted. I mean, to announce their presence in this matchup with authority. Very decisive. It can definitely be considered a statement win for the Nets. Look at their number of assists. You know, they didn't get stuck in those one-on-one -on -one situations, and they got the ball to the guys with the best matchups. Easy drives, open jumpers, and great ball movement. And you can mark this one down in the W column. It'll mark their 23rd of the season. And with the win approaching, they'll take the first game here of two that they'll play against this team. Nice to get that first one out of the way and set the tone. And guys, one of the steady and outstanding players putting in another impressive performance, it was a big time outing for Kyrie Irving. He just looked like an orchestrator out there. His teammates kept running to the open spot and he found them time and time again. Pass to Harris, jacks up a three. Rebound the Lakers. 34 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. Offensive rebound. Fouled on the hey, shot and picks up two points. So one free throw coming up. Well, there are few better at hitting the Defensive glass than DeAndre Jordan. DeAndre he is always Denver. amongst the leaders in rebounding. That's his first personal foul. Second team foul. At the line for the Lakers, DeAndre Jordan. At the line for one. Free throw good, Jordan. 
Well, when DeAndre Jordan is engaged, this guy is flat out a difference maker. He understands how to play to his strengths. The shot and game clock separated by four. Carter, the pass to Harris. Shoots over Bazemore. Harris missing again. Now here's Ellington. Defense right on him. Kicks it to Bazemore. A shot, no good. And so it's Brooklyn easily grabbing this one. A resounding victory for them. And Greg in enemy territory, no less. Hey, that's exactly right. But with the way they controlled the game and, and just completely took the crowd out of it, that's how to get it done on the road. And that about wraps it up for Doris Burke, David Aldridge, Greg Anthony, and the rest of our terrific 2K Sports crew. This is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. So long and good night, everyone. winner was E. Matthews 12. He saved the game with the last second block. Get that out of here, son! You know defense saves the day. And from episode 9, your winner was G3000 with the picture perfect ankle break jam! Selected guarding EJ. Snatching ankles with Donovan Mitchell. Which play soars above all the rest like a pelican. You know I rock with the pals. Anyway, vote now for your top plays of season two. And remember, you can be on 2K TV by submitting your best plays using the hashtag 2K TV Wild. Thanks to everybody out there. It's definitely been a blast, and I'll see you inside Pelicans games in NBA 2K22. Let go. The famous We Love Houston sign just off I-10. We're in Clutch City for our game tonight at the Toyota Center. Happy holidays, everyone. Welcome to our coverage of the NBA on 2K Sports. And our broadcast team tonight, Grant Hill and Steve Smith. Allie LaForce, our reporter. Allie, it's all yours. Ryan, as the NBA pivots away from the post and towards the perimeter, we're seeing more teams employ three-guard lineups to great effect, trading some size for skill. We'll see if the trend continues, but guys, for now, it seems that even if there's only one ball, having multiple ball handlers can be very effective. Well, very interesting, Allie. Good stuff there. Thank you. And the Lakers starting five. We've got Anthony Davis, Trevor Ariza out there with LeBron James. Then it's MP, and it's Westbrook in at the point. And for the Rockets, manning the backcourt, it's Wall and Green. Tate and Tice holding down the forward spots. And it's Wood in at the five. Well, Smitty, the NBA has been adjusting the start times for games, trying to find the right balance. How does that impact players, you think? I think for players, B.A., they definitely notice the changes at first. But these players are resilient. They get used to it pretty quickly. Pass to Ariza. To the inside. Oh, it's stolen by Tice. 
Tate passes to Wood. Back to Tate. To the paint. And it's blocked by Davis. Green against James. MP. That falls. MP. Nice feed that time Assisted from James. Inside the paint, James. MP looks fearless, doing whatever it takes to find his shot. Pass to Green. Tice left side. Ooh, stolen by Westbrook. In transition. Here's Ariza. Well-timed pass, and he goes straight to the bucket for the layup. Very high IQ play by MP, giving it away to the guy with a wide open look. Wall on the attack. Shoots over Westbrook. Wall no good. Here's MP. Rebounded by Green. Wall with it. He's picked up by Westbrook. And there's Green on the assist by Wall. And being that Wall is a point guard, it's his responsibility to facilitate. Just a terrific dime right there. James against Tice. Here's MP. Laid it in with a nice MP. touch off the window. MP's got his second basket. Just taking it right to the rim. And no one was there to greet him. Wow, that's a defensive breakdown. Can't do that against good scores. Now here's Wall. Continues to make an impact on offense. Putting up 21 a game. And here's Tate outside. Can't get it to drop. And maybe it's the adrenaline talking. But they're one for four to start this game. Need to settle down. It's a shot you would think he would make. But he just doesn't make it all the time. Green, the pass to Wall. That's good. His first made shot in three attempts. The lift still there for Wall. Awesome to see him competing, especially when you remember that serious Achilles injury. It's good. MP's got six. Just over two and a half minutes played here in the first. Outside Tate. Pass to Green. 11 feet out. James with the rebound. Trying to take advantage of soft defense. He might have gotten over eager. Well, it's been eight years since LeBron won his fourth MVP trophy. A player who's regarded as the best of his generation. Hard to argue he shouldn't have more. Now here's Tate. He's averaging about six points per game. Floats one up. Wall. Rebounded by Russell Westbrook. The Lakers have gone four of seven, shooting a solid percentage. MP shot is off. And LeBron has admitted some irritation with the MVP voting in the past. Yes, B.A., he's come in second in the vote four times. That's tied with Jerry West and Larry Bird for the most in NBA history. This is a guy accustomed to deciding outcomes. This one is out of his hands. Boy, they need something to go to regain some confidence. No question. Way too many empty possessions for them. Outside Tate. Takes it inside. He's now one for two with that bucket. Beautiful call that time up the floor. The hard screen frees him up for the bunny. Westbrook outside. Pass to Davis. Here's MP. Rockets with a rebound. Yeah, just a little off his game this quarter. He's trying to work his way into a rhythm. Here's Green. Oh, it's no good. That would have tied it. The Lakers in the lead. It's James on the wing. He's covered by Tate. Here's Ariza. He's averaging almost five points a game. The foul called on MP. MP. That's his first foul of the game. That's his first a fantastic first foul. mobile one block. First this one deserves foul. another look. That'll put some fear into the shooters, and he made sure to do it early, too. Well, the Rockets shooting an unremarkable 30% in the first. Wall against Westbrook. And the big finish by Wall. An athletic display by Wall. Letting the defense know he can hold the rim. The Lakers call timeout. Last time, they met in Los Angeles. 
and they came away with the win because everyone contributed. The starters, the bench, they all played as a unit. Great scoring output from that second unit. Such a luxury to have that extra ammunition. The Lakers have gone 4 of 10 shooting the rock in this first quarter. And he lobs it up top and Anthony finished Davis. off by Davis. You won't find a much better alley-oop partner. AD flying to the rim. Here's Wall coming in off 21 points in his last outing. Outside, Green. The Lakers with a rebound. Westbrook's got four rebounds now. Davis with it. Checked by Wall. James. That's in there. Davis with the assist. This goes to Savvy Anthony ball Davis. movement by Anthony Davis. Making good use of his floor vision. Stolen by MP. And it's the Lakers on the break. Here's Westbrook. Good setup. Russell, Led him to the Russell. rack perfectly for the layup. And you know Coach loves seeing his offense operate at this level. Great passing out there. Outside wall. Outside green. To shoot. And that's foul number two for him. You leave him in. Obviously, you don't want him to pick up a third foul. Horton Tucker, he's checked in for the Lakers. Finds Tate. Down to five on the shot clock. Pass to Wood. And it's blocked by Davis. He gives you at that end. He's made the... Look at the energy stats. How the hustle game has been going for the Lakers. They're doing a great job defensively down low. They've already racked up a lot of blocks. They've established an intimidation factor early in also like what they've done on the fast break in their first half tonight. Getting it to them. Anthony's checked in for Ariza. The Lakers have gone 8 for 14 from the floor. Westbrook outside. Gordon Tucker on the wing. Anthony outside. It's James on the wing. That's good. Long and so Westbrook with the assist. And the Lakers lead by 11. Getting out to a nice lead. Great flow and great execution. And the Rockets call time here. And we've heard those telling LeBron to shut up and dribble and stay out of it when it comes to social issues. Fortunately, he has no intention of standing on the sidelines. Making some changes. Martin, he's checked in for Wood, and it's Nawaba in for Green. On the wing, Porter, pounded by Westbrook. Pass to Shangun. Back to Porter. Trying to get back on track. The shot no good. Westbrook with the defensive effort. And LeBron not just raising his voice, he's helped others do the same is more than a vote initiative instrumental in getting record numbers to the polls, Smitty. Opening up NBA arenas as voting centers, you want a government by the people, for the people. The ballot is how you do it. Count that one. Carmel what a way to begin this game. 
dominating at both ends of the floor. They came in prepared, focused, and really jumped on the other team early. Back to Martin. Oh, and there's a one-hand jam. Now, B.A., you know they would love for him to get more of those opportunities. Well, that would cut into the deficit quickly if he does. Here's James. The shot comes out, and Houston will come the other way. I love how they've attacked the boards here in the first quarter. Count it. Good execution. They're getting some short-range looks here. And so it's the Lakers with it. Nine-point game. Pass to Horton Tucker. Down low. And it's James with the jam. And early on, they've been on a tear. Just getting whatever they want offensively. They established the pace. They made shots. This is why they're way out in front. Now here's Porter. Boy, no scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. Here's Shangun. Checked by James. Clock at six. Here's Gordon. Another one falls for Houston. And despite the defender's length, he goes right up from the mid-range. And you know what? There was probably a better matchup on the floor, but when it goes in, nobody complains. It's good. LeBron James has got eight. Defensively, their effort hasn't been great early on. Gordon, the pass to Nwaba. Pass to Porter. He takes it in. James with the rebound. And it's a Lakers ball. They're on a 17-6 run. And Anthony finished Davis. off by Davis. Assisted. The offensive Russell game plan Westbrook. is clear. Get it inside and go to work. This is my type of approach. Get some high percentage looks. Then later, you can play inside out. Here's Shengun. Right now contributing around 10.5 points a game. Pass to Porter. Two minutes remaining in the first. And he drives in. Two minutes. So it'll be two Boston free throws. Foul. He was fouled in the act of shooting. Anthony Davis. It's going to be on That's Anthony Davis. Everyone in the building Third saw the obvious foul. contact. At the line for your Rockets, Kevin Porter Jr. Two shots. And he makes a first. And some changes here for the Lakers. Howard's checked in for Anthony Davis. Monk comes in for James. And it's Rondo in for Russell Westbrook. Porter hits them both. 157 left in the first. Pass to Howard. Anthony, left side. Great D that time from Nuaba. Well, the Rockets shooting only 37% early. Gordon on the wing. Here's Shangun. Six on the shot clock. Pass to Porter. Let's it go from the wing. No good there. So the Lakers will take it the other way. Here's Horton Tucker. Outside Monk. Now here's Rondo. Knocks it loose. And against Monk. Malik Lays Monk. it up and banks it in. And it gets even worse for them. I mean, he just waltzes down the lane, extending their advantage. Ugh, not good. A uncontested shot at the rim. You have to compete at all times. Now here's Gordon. He's been contributing over 15 a game. And another miss by Houston. Now Los Angeles with it. 13-point lead. Left side, Rondo. Fast break, here we go. Outside for Porter. Back to Nwaba. 
Late clock. Houston's got to hurry. And out of bounds. Out of bounds. Los Angeles will have it. Lakers ball. Lakers substitution. DeAndre Jordan. Here's Rondo. Looking for his first basket still in this one. Three-pointer Anthony. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers in a good situation. Up by 13 points to close the quarter. Their defensive efforts have paid off. Effectively shutting down the opposing offense. Back to the game after this break. And the great LeBron James says he's not focused on numbers. It's all about getting that W. There's no pressure for none of us to score. There's no pressure for any of us to do more than, than you have to. Um, you know, for me, I'm just, I'm whatever. I'm, I'm all about winning. Grant, it's all about playing the right way, isn't it? It really is, B.A. And when you're playing team basketball, that removes some of the pressure. When it comes down to it, hero ball often falls short. We welcome you back to second quarter action. Plenty of basketball left to play, but this one has been one-sided so far. And for the Lakers, this has been the game they wanted to have. Well, I think it's pretty obvious they were well-prepared defensively coming in. Yes, what they do, they take away the things that teams like to do offensively, also keeping them out of sync. So on the floor for the Lakers to kick off the second quarter. Dwight Howard out there with Anthony. Then it's Malik Monk. Then there's Rajon Rondo. And it's Jordan in at the five. Here's Martin. Six to shoot. To the middle. Gordon can't hit. Everything right except the finish. Have to keep focus all the way through the play. And he lobs it up. Stolen away. Nice job to interrupt the alley-oop attempt. Ooh, Howard with a block. And he recovers it. And for Los Angeles, they're shooting very well. 62% and going right at the defense. Monk passes to Howard. The three ball. Kept alive. Outside, Rondo. Anthony against Gordon. Anthony misses. The Rockets have gone 0 for 4 in the second quarter on the wing porter. Now here's Nwaba. Well, he hasn't scored yet, but I'm sure that'll change. Gordon outside from downtown. And they get it back. Second chance shot. No good. A bit long that time. The Lakers have gotten only one of four shots to go in. Here's Monk. Slam dunk by Jordan. One of the great rebounders in this league. When Jordan does score, this is often how it happens. Timeout, Timeout call. Houston. Houston. All right, Smitty, you won some titles at the international level. A world championship in 94, gold in 2000. So how do those compare to the ring you won with the Spurs? You know, B.A., they're totally different. Obviously, both of them are fantastic. But internationally, it's a little bit special because you're playing for your country and you have that USA across your jersey.
regroup for the Rockets. Ariz is checked in for the Lakers. MP comes in for Rondo. Wood passes to Wall. Ooh, too long in the paint. And he's hit with a three-second violation. Rocket ball! And the technical free throw is good. Hey, Jalen Green kind of started his career with a big moment, being the first player to join the Ignite team in the G League. We got a taste of the NBA style of play. Now here's Green. 17 points in his last outing. And there's Wall. That one's good. On the assist by Green. Wall's got seven. Some speedy shooting from Wall. He gets the pass and puts his shot right up to beat the D. Well, MP in the last matchup against the Nets came through when they needed him to. He had 12 points and created for his teammates, finding them in their favorite spots. He showed just how reliable he can be when his role on the floor is expanded. Guys, back to you. Yeah, well, he put forth a commanding performance and led the charge for his squad. Yeah, it's clear this guy is unafraid. He relishes the opportunity to take over for his team. Whether he's scoring, facilitating, hitting the glass, his focus is just to provide whatever they need for the win. Not sure if that's the shot you were looking for, but it's a Watch fairly clean down. look. Almost and have he... to take it. The seasoning Jalen Green picked up in the G League really did help strengthen his game. Yeah, but yeah, I mean, what a great opportunity for him to grow as a player, allowing him to continue sharpening his skills by playing against league caliber talents. Got the ball where he wanted it, but then got swarmed. Pass to Ariza. Back to Monk. Inside. Here's MP. Feeling the defense, MP able to draw the contact and get to the strike. First team foul. At the line for the Lakers. MP. Free throw good, MP. At the line for two. Good on both. Well, before MP made it to the league, we all saw his stuff on social media, and it's been fun to watch MP grow over the years. Puts it up from 15. And another miss by Houston. You like that he's still attacking, but the results tonight just haven't been there. And it's Howard finishing it off. With the explosive leaping ability, he's able to play center despite being undersized. Houston has gone one of three from three-point land here in the second quarter. Outside wall. Jacks up a three. Howard grabs the miss. Howard's got four rebounds now. The Lakers have gotten four of their first nine shots to go here in the second. Jordan high post. Green against Monk. Five on the clock. To the inside. MP shot is off. He's off on the layup. Well, the Rockets shooting just 24% in this one. Not great. And it's Green missing. The Lakers dominating the game. 19-point lead, which is the largest margin of the game. To the paint. And there's a whistle. He'll head to the line to shoot two. That one on tape. Shooting for Los Angeles. Dwight Howard taking two shots. And the first one at the line is good. The Lakers making a switch here. Westbrook's checked in. And that's good as he hits both shots. Yeah, they, they're really cashing in more at the line here in the second quarter. Outside, Green. The ball's knocked loose. And it goes out of bounds. That one off Green. Lakers ball. LeBron, he's checked in for the Lakers. Substitution. LeBron James. The Lakers with the ball. Their defense is only allowed four points in the quarter. They've got numbers. Here's Tate. Ooh, and he took a hard foul on the shot. 
So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. That's his first personal foul. The first free throw is good. Team foul. At the line for Houston. Jay Sean Tate. He does not get the second one. This is why you want ball movement and player movement. And that's made it hard for the defense to and key in he. on any one individual. I love how MP reads the floor. He often sees openings before anyone else. And it's the Rockets with the ball. The Lakers getting their last shot to go. To the middle. Here's Green. The Lakers with a rebound. They keep calling his number, which is partly how they've dug this hole. Now James. Give him eight. Five to shoot. The Lakers got to get one up. Late clock. And, and yep, it's good. MP's got 12. LeBron and credit the coaching James. here. You know if you can get MP into a rhythm, he can take over. Pass to Tate. Tice, right side. And a nice finish on the layup. That's been the story of their offense so far. Getting a number of looks from point-blank range. Here's James. Some solid D from Wood. Houston has gone only one of five from beyond the three-point line in the second quarter. Down low. Boy, left it right in the sweet spot with the lob. Nicely done. Oh, what a pass. Those two read each other really well. Looks like a play they've definitely run in practice. Oh, it's stolen by Tice. To the inside. And denied. He sends it right off the glass. And slam dunk by James. James. If you're the defense, you have to get back. LeBron, a monster out in the open court. And it's Houston's ball. They're moving on after the tough loss they took at the hands of the Hornets. Yeah, they found some decent looks, but the shots just weren't falling. <laughs> Sometimes it goes like that. They never really got into a rhythm despite trying a few different things. Sometimes it's just not your night. Now here's Wall. He has seven. The Lakers with a rebound. Howard's got nine rebounds in the game. Boy, he's getting it done. Here's MP. That shot missing. Green with the defensive effort. Here's Wall. And another miss by Houston. And for his offense, this has just been a brutal period. Pass to James. Inside. Here's MP. The shot's MP. good on the assist by James. Assisted by James has got a sixth James. assist of the night. They have no answer defensively inside. Here's Wall. And it's Wall again missing. And he just hasn't been able to get it going this period. And you've seen they've made numerous attempts to try to get him going. Shows how valuable he is to this offense. MP. Got it. They're playing great team basketball. It's good movement and sharp, crisp passing. Back to Wall. Wood outside to the paint. Here's Green. He's got it. Just two of seven from the field, though. This team looks to him to score the ball. They feel good when he's taking the shots. The Lakers call timeout. They come into this one following a loss to Brooklyn. Yeah, I think they'd like to forget that game. You usually want to find some teaching moments, but in this case, it might be best to just destroy the tape. Nothing wrong with that. Sometimes we overanalyze things. Can be better to just let it go. Your Clutch City Tempers. All right, look who's coming out of the court. Get loud for your Clutch. So for the Rockets, 
Gordon comes in for Tate. And it's Porter Jr. in for Wall. And so it's the Lakers with it. Westbrook outside. Westbrook drawing the double. Down low. Davis. Anthony That's Davis. good. And so Westbrook assist with the assist. Russell. Westbrook's Russell. got eight assists in the game. Houston has gone only one of five from beyond the three-point line in the second quarter. And Russell Westbrook on the move once again, this time to the Lakers. Now, what's interesting, I mean, he played so long for the OKC Thunder and now on his fourth team in the past four years. But still, you can't deny the impact when he's on the floor. Tice passes to Porter. And then Porter with the dunk. Kevin Porter Jr. Talk about taking advantage of the opportunity. How about the anticipation right there that led to the steal? Then he goes straight to the bucket. Great activity at both ends. Great teamwork as well. And the Lakers making a change here. Rondo's checked in. At the line for one. Getting themselves to the line this quarter is a good way to get their offense rolling. And so it's the Lakers with it. Pass to Horton Tucker. To the inside. And that one's good. Davis. Davis. Davis has got four points in the quarter. That's ten straight points they've given up in the painted area. Huh. And here's Porter. He's got five. Gordon outside. Two minutes remaining in the first half. Now here's Nova. He's closely guarded. Just five to shoot. Here's Porter. That shot, no good. Now the Lakers take it the other way. And they're up considerably because of their efforts on the glass. Pass to Davis. Westbrook outside for three. That one falls. Russell, Coming off Russell. Davis' feed. Westbrook's got five now. The assist numbers certainly stand out. <laughs> They've really emphasized ball movement here today. Here's Shangun. Now here's Gordon. Shoots over Davis. Rebounded by Russell Westbrook. Westbrook's got six rebounds in the game. He can't get a shot to go this quarter. Might want to get others more involved. Here's Davis. And finished Anthony off Davis. by Davis. You see the weight that AD's added to his frame over the years. Now invites contact. Outside Nwaba. Pass to Porter. Shot to stop the run. And it's good on the layup. Seven points in the game. That's a well-timed, well-coordinated play. Comes right off the pick for the lay-in. Now Westbrook. The offensive rebound. Anthony with a bucket. And I love how they're working much harder on the glass this quarter and drumming up more second-chance opportunities. Trying to find a spark here. Yes, indeed. A rough stretch offensively. They could really use a basket. How many shots has he missed this quarter? Might be time to find offense elsewhere. Count Anthony that bucket. Davis. The added strength goes helping Davis on these Carmel physical Anthony. finishes. Great work from the big man. Gordon outside. Shoots over Westbrook. Here's Martin. Ooh, he released it in time, but it's off the mark. So as we conclude the first half, a fairly one-sided game. The Lakers on top, opening up a huge gap. And we'll be back for the second half following the break. Keep it right here on 2K Sports. With the second half upon us, we'll find out if this game becomes the route that it's threatening to be. Hey, you look at MP in this game. He's been everywhere. 
Can they come up with an answer for him coming out of the half? They have to change something defensively. I think both sides probably adjusted a few things. The key for him is to bring the same level of energy over these last two quarters. Tate and Tice holding down the forward spots. Manning the backcourt, it's Wall and Green. And it's Wood in at the five, down low. That's the five for Houston right now. Green, the pass to Wall. Back to Wood. And he's Wood going to the line five. for two. The official the saw contact game. while he was going up. That's his first personal And you foul. get some traditional first big man foul. stuff from Wood. But you look at his handles, at going one-on-one -on -one outside the painted area. Wood. Most centers can't do Taking all the things that he can do. Shots. And he can't get the first one. And Wood's shown great versatility on offense. But the same skill set applies on the defensive end as well. I mean, he can switch. He slides on the perimeter to protect the rim. His skill set is exactly what scouts are looking for now at the center position. So neither attempt will fall that time for him. Los Angeles shooting 59% in this one. A good average. Oh, it's stolen by Tice. Wall against Westbrook. And there's the lob. And out of bounds. Los Angeles will have it. You want unselfishness, but you also need to keep it under control. And now another look at that mobile one block defensive performance. Oh, showing no signs of giving up this lead. That block sent shockwaves into the opposition sails. And a minute played as the second half gets going. James passes to Westbrook. Now MP. Wall covering. MP. Not going to go that time. Some solid D from Wood. The Rockets shooting a poor 25% for this game so far. And it's Green missing. And the Lakers have possession. They haven't given up any points here in the second half. Green against Westbrook. It's stolen by Green. And the foul called on MP. That'll get him his fourth That's foul his of the game. This foul. could be a problem. That's his second fourth team. foul with plenty of basketball left to play. Third quarter of play with just over one and a half minutes gone by. Pass to Green. Back to Tate. And here's Wall. Just five on the clock. And whether or not he makes the all-defensive team, LeBron is one of the league's premier defenders. Starting to have with Davis. three straight misses. Not how they envisioned this one. Gliding the pass to where it needed to be. Wow, a strong finish to seal the deal. Outside wall. Outside Tate. Davis with a rebound. They just don't have it right now. 0 for 4. Must have been one poor speech at halftime. MP. MP. That one's good. And force feeding the ball inside. LeBron I mean, James. no reason to go away from what's working. Just over two and a half minutes gone by in the second half. It's Tate on the wing. Tice against James. To the middle. And Tice with the bucket. The assist from Tate. Well, they get one to drop. A little relief after four straight misses to start the half. Pass to Ariza. Inside. Here's MP. It's going to be on LeBron James. That'll be a second foul of the game. And another great assist. The offense is really clicking now.
The Rockets have gotten just one of five shots to drop since halftime. Offensively, it's been a struggle for them. Yeah, they need to string together some shots to have any kind of chance. Knocked away. Tate against Davis. And it's blocked by Davis. Rebounded by Green. Green's got a rebound number five here tonight. Pass to Wood from outside the arc. Here's Tice. The third shot of the possession finally falls for him. Tice has got six points. The defense getting out hustled on the putback. Can't let that happen. For some reason, blocking out has become a lost art, and that's the result you'll get. Now here's Davis. He's got 14, MP. and he gets that one. And talk about imposing your will. That's 10 straight points in the paint. Outside, green. To the left wing. Here's Wood. Lays it up and in on the nice reverse. His nimbleness makes him a unique threat at the rim. The Lakers have gone four of six from the floor in this third quarter. Westbrook outside. It's James on the wing. Tice defending. Here's Davis. And the bucket Rocket counts. Foul. And he is on his way to the line. He'll try to make That's it a three-point play. Well, you need at least two stars to win big. It sure helps when they fit together as well as LeBron James and Anthony Davis. They complement each other perfectly. Jordan's checked in for the Lakers. Monk comes in for MP. And LeBron said, when Anthony Davis came, we're running our offense through him. NBA, LeBron's a man of his word. In their first season playing together, James assisted Anthony Davis on more baskets than he had done for any prior teammate, hand and glove. And it's Green missing. The Lakers have gotten five of seven attempts in the third quarter. A moment to hear from Ali LaForce. Malik Thanks, Monk. B.A. Well, the players on two-way contracts getting expanded opportunities last season after the league eliminated the 50-game cap and permitted them to take part in the playoffs. The pandemic played a role, but, guys, teams are continuing to find contributors among these scrappy Westbrook. young players. Well, it's all about opportunity, Ali. Thanks. It's empowering to play with LeBron because if you get open, he will find you. Back to Tate. And good. Coming on the assist by Wall. Tate's got five now. Well orchestrated. And then the pass is right on the money. Throws it up high. Deflects the pass. Pass to Tice. Outside Wall. Shot from 12. Westbrook with the rebound. Westbrook's got nine rebounds in the game. Boy, he's getting it done. Shot's good by James. He's got 12. Just so successful getting the ball inside and finding those great looks. To the right side. Back to Wall. Pass to Tice. Here's Wall. Just five to shoot. And the big finish by Wall. Oh, oh nice feed. On time and on target. Los Angeles has gone three of six from deep so far. Now, here is James. Back to Westbrook. Again, the Lakers. <laughs> they are passing the ball around tremendously right now. Wall, the pass to Wood. The Lakers with a rebound. Down low. Here's James. The shot won't fall. So Houston will take it the other way. Outside, Green. Outside, Tate. Pass to Wall. And 
And the big finish by Wall. And look at those moves in the post. And the smooth finish to go along with it. Just excellent work around the rim. Now here's Westbrook. He's got nine. It's rebounded by Houston. Green's got six rebounds here tonight. It's Tate on the wing. And that comes Good off the job. assist by Green. Tate's got four points now in the quarter. High percentage look. This is what your offense is designed to do. Tate against James. Westbrook outside. Right side, Monk. The three is up. Nails it from three. Monk. Monk's got ten points in the game. Very consistent tonight at the offensive end. Right there, he helps fuel the fire. Tate passes to Wall. Back to Tate. Let's go with a three. The Lakers with a rebound. James has got rebound number eight here already in the game. Oh, there's the alley! Anthony and Davis. Davis slams it home. When Anthony Davis gets in a rhythm like this, it's good for the whole team. The other guys feed off his energy. Now here's Wall. He's got 11. James with the ball. Oh, stolen by Tate. Pass to Wall. Let's a three fly. Rebound collected by Anthony Davis. He made a three back in the first half, but that's it. We'll see if he can find his stroke. James finds Davis. Left side Monk from behind the arc. And the three-pointer goes. 13 three. points in the game. Here in the second half, they're really focused on stretching the floor. This was obviously a focal point coming out of the break. Look smart when the shots are going down. Now here's Wall. Continues to make an impact on offense. Putting up 21 a game. Oh, rejected by Jordan. DeAndre is simply one of the most electrifying shot blockers in the game. If you put up a shot around him, you better put it up high. So it's both teams making substitutions here. Here's James. 12 points for him. Here's Horton Tucker. Pass to Rondo. Down to five on the shot clock. Two minutes remaining in the third. Two With his first shot attempt. They get it back. Jordan. And good work on the boards as they picked up the second chance points. Size and strength of DeAndre Jordan. Brushing off the defender. Things just don't seem to be clicking for them offensively. Yeah, they really need to find a way to get back on track. Here's Martin. A shot to stop the drought, and he jams it home with authority. Hey, when in doubt, run the defender off the screen. And you know, with a result like that, we'll see them run it again. Especially if the defense is going to allow you to do it. Have to switch on that play. Now here's Jordan. Here's James. And it's James with the jam. Anytime you can get LeBron something right at the rim, that's good offense. Gordon, the pass to Porter. To the inside. And stolen by Anthony. Fast break. Here come the Lakers. From 15 feet away. And the basket by Horton Tucker. Their ball movement on this run has been tremendous. It's led to a lot of good, clean, open looks. Pass to Porter. 41 seconds left in the third quarter. Here's Nwaba. Good work defensively by James. Might like a do over there. Quality look inside. And Rondo, here we go. Banked it in off the glass. Rondo, he's got his first points of the game. Hey, they're just getting pushed around inside. There's 21 seconds left in the third quarter. James against Nawaba. Shot clock at six. Porter in the post. He hits 
it just before the shot clock expires. Porter's got his third basket on the night right there. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers showing no mercy and just piling it on, looking dominant and focused right now. It hasn't taken them too many shots to get their points. They're winning with efficiency. We'll be right back. And it's time to bring up the State Farm assist to the game. He's always near the top of the list for this honor. I mean, passes like these are his specialty. This is what you need your floor general to do. Take charge, lead by example, unselfish play. And there have been two very different performances from these teams today as we get going in quarter number four. On the court for the Lakers to start the fourth. Carmelo Anthony out there with DeAndre Jordan. Then there's Taylor Horton Tucker. Then there's Wayne Ellington. And it's Rondo in at the one. Here's Anthony. Coming Christian out of the Wood is checked the in for the Rockets. Green comes in for Nwaba. Fourth quarter of play and over three and a half minutes have gone by now. MP shot is off. And wrestling for it there, but no one has possession. We'll have a jump ball. It'll be a jump ball. So it's the Rockets now. And for many years, we heard that the great seven-footers went extinct. But you have the MVP in Jokic, Joel Embiid, Anthony Davis. Maybe it was just a temporary low. Well, it kind of was. I think, B.A., the game went to outside in. And now with these guys, they're making the game come back to inside out. And I am loving it. Here's Rondo following the score by Houston. Pass to Howard. Outside, Rondo. Five to shoot. To the paint. Oh, sweet move. And they turn it over. Shot clock violation is the buzzer sound. Houston ball. And it's Houston's ball. They're on a 14-6 run. Pass to Wood. From the baseline. Ariza pulls down the board. Ariza's got rebound number five here tonight. Here's Ellington. Cash. It's Wayne MP Ellington. picking up the assist. MP's got six assists here tonight. Wood outside. Green with the ball. And he can't answer back. The three-pointer offline. And here's the fast break. It's tipped. It's stolen by Green. Here's House. Well, your seven seconds or less suns really paved the way for the pace and space Who's style that we see throughout the league today, Grant. You know, B.A. it really did. But, you know, it's interesting. I think there were those back then that thought it was kind of gimmicky. <laughs> but, boy, has it changed. And I, I feel like we could have had more success if we had just gone all in on that approach. Beautiful location on the pass, as usual. Led his man perfectly. Outside, green. Back to Augustine. And the foul called on MP. That'll be foul number five on him. Just a little too aggressive. His fifth foul of the night. Expect him to go right at him to try to pick up number six. Baysmore's checked in for the Lakers. Now here's Augustine. Pass to green. Shot clock at five. Launches a three. Rebounded by the Lakers. Down low. Here's MP. 
The basket he's drops, and he gets fouled on the Jay shot. Green. One free throw coming his That's way. His just foul. a fiery and one play by MP. The he hits the foul the and just keeps pushing to get the bucket. MP. And a moment to look at the at scoring the approach in terms of where the points are coming from for Los Angeles. What tremendous passing we've seen from them today. A very unselfish performance all around. And another thing, they're doing a great job of getting inside and converting around the rim. <laughs> I really love their aggressiveness. Houston has gone two of six so far in the fourth. Outside, green. Pass to Garuba. And the shot goes down. Daniel Hart with the dime. And Grant, you've been around the game in so many roles. Been a player, broadcaster, owner. Talk about how the game has grown and the opportunities for continued growth. Well, we know how the game here in the U.S. has really gained prominence and is hugely successful and popular. And I also think that's happened over the years globally as well. But continuing to popularize the game in Africa, India, China, and elsewhere is exciting. There are so many new frontiers for this league to grow, and I'm excited that we're moving forward in that direction. Now here's Green. Fires the three, and Augustine gets it to go. Here in the second half, you see they've gone to the long ball to try to keep up. It's Bazemore on the wing. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. Bazemore has dramatically improved at the line since he came into the lead. A big plus for his team. Shooting for Los Angeles. Kent Bazemore. Two shots. First free throw is good. You know, he was undrafted out of Old Dominion. Ken Bazemore has come a long way. Didn't get much run his first few years in the league, but now he's an impact player. All right, the Rockets making a switch here. Nuava's checked in, and the Lakers also making a switch. Jordan's checked in. Houston has gone three of seven from the perimeter during the fourth. Left side, Nuava. Pass to Augustine. And he wills that one in, sinking it right through the back of the iron. Augustine's got five points now in the quarter. Now, here is Howard. Here's Ellington. Fires from the wing. Wood grabs the board. Hey, sometimes the best looks don't equate to points. The three from Nuava. And it's Jordan with the rebound. Jordan's got a rebound number eight here already in the game. Pass to Bazemore. And the top pick in this year's draft, Cade Cunningham. Grant, I heard some insiders compare you to him. You like those comparisons? Well, he's 6'8 with skill, sees the floor, I think approaches the game the right way. Maybe not the leaper I was, but tremendously talented, and I'm so eager to see how he develops. He's got a bright future in front of him. Augustine, unable to get that one. And Los Angeles the other way now. Here's Bazemore. He's covered by Augustine. And he's going for the oop here. And DeAndre slam Jordan. dunk by Jordan. What strength by DeAndre. Really love seeing him sky up for the thunderous slam. Well, the Rockets shooting an even 50% since the fourth quarter got underway. Wood outside. Back to Augustine. To the inside. And Wood with the stuff. Everyone loves the alley -oop play, B.A. Yep, one of the prettiest in basketball. The Lakers have gotten 8 of 16 attempted shots to go here in the fourth. Now, here is Howard. Pass to Ellington. MP outside. And here's Howard. Five on the clock. It's Bazemore on the wing. Guarded by Wood. Rockets foul. Christian Wood. That's his the first, first one falls. Foul. Fourth team foul. At the line for the Lakers. 
Kent Bazemore taking two shots. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. And the Rockets shooting only 34% in this one. Here's Augustine. Goes back up. Blocked! Quick off the floor. Beautiful standing reach. Baysmore surprising you with the block. Los Angeles has gone three for three from downtown in this fourth quarter. Two minutes remaining in the Smitty, game. Players are more Two connected today with social media than ever before. You think it helps squash problems or does it foster rivalries? Well, I mean, you, we've seen it on both sides. Some of these guys, obviously rivalries and a lot of chatter is talk between social media. And a lot of these guys are friends. It's just the way you use it. I think it can be an advantage or a disadvantage at times. Here's House. Here's Nwaba. No good from 11 feet. It's safe to say they have dominated this game. The game wasn't even as close as the score says in a great win for the Lakers. MP. And you don't usually see this kind of blowout, but tonight they delivered the punishment. I mean, what's so impressive is they never wavered in their approach. They just kept at it and showed they were without a doubt the better team. Looking at this year so far, this will make 22 wins for them. And that'll put a little extra meaning on their next game. No team wants to go 0 for 4 against an opponent, no matter who it is. And of all the highlights and performances and we've team. seen here tonight, the one Assistant. thing that stands out was what an unbelievable night it's been for Anthony Davis. When it comes to protecting the rim, there are numerous ways to do that. The most excited of those just send shots back. And that's what he did tonight in volume. And so it's the Lakers with it. Pass to MP. Great D that time from Nwaba. Outside Augustine. Into the lane. Lakers foul. Kent Bazemore. That's his first personal foul. First one falls for him. And the Rockets making a change here. Martin's checked in. And the Lakers also making a switch. Ariz has checked in for Howard. So it's the Lakers now. It's Ellington on the wing. Back to MP. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. MP's got 31. Excellent effort on the road. They've literally sucked the energy out of this arena. And when you're on the road, you can't be tentative coming into a game like this. I thought their aggressive approach was the difference. To the middle. Augustine with the rebound. Well, they're going to win, so he should just... And so it's the Lakers easily grabbing this one. This one wasn't even close. The hometown crowd was waiting for a miracle that never came. Yeah, and this team was consistent throughout. They met every challenge, and they earned this dub. And that about wraps it up. For Grand Hill, Steve Smith and Ali LaForce, this is Brian Anderson. Thanks for watching tonight's game. We'll see you later. Cause I'm a bucket. It's what I do. When you're doing what you do, don't it feel good? But what about defense? Is that not what you do? <laughs> of course I play D. But it's more fun to score. That's just facts. But what does Coach think of that philosophy? <laughs> Everyone brings something different to the table, and Coach respects that. That's what being a team's all about. Just so happens I get buckets, and getting buckets is fun. You shouldn't read too much into it, Frank. <laughs>